Hey guys, welcome back to our channel. This channel where science is all about trying to learn various concepts or the science by practicing a lot of questions. In this video, we are going to solve this question or lead code regarding highest salaries difference. The difficulty level of this question is easy and I'm going to share the SQL schema as well as the Panda schema in the description box below. Okay, the question reads, we are given a table called salaries with three different columns, employee name, department and salary. The combined columns, employee name and department is the primary key that is combination of unique values for this table. Each row of this table contains employee name, department and salary there will be at least one entry for the engineering and marketing departments okay we are asked to write a solution to calculate the difference between the highest salaries in the marketing and engineering department output the absolute difference in salaries return the result table okay let's go through the example so here we have multiple people their department and the salary so in the engineering department what is the maximum salary 102000 and then in the marketing department what is the maximum salary 53,000. So if you subtract them, you are going to get the absolute difference to be 49,000. And that is what you have. So what we can do is we can get the maximum salary when the department is engineering. We can also get the maximum salary when the department is marketing and subtract the two. And once we have the value, we can get the absolute of it as well. So what we can do is from this table called salaries, let's keep only those rows where department is equal to engineering. And for those departments, let's get the maximum of the salary column. And that is going to give us the maximum of the engineering department. Let's wrap this in parentheses so that, okay, this is one value that we are going to get. Then similarly, we are also going to get, okay, if I go ahead and copy this, because we do need to do the same thing, right? So instead of writing the same thing again, we just need to change department to marketing. So we also got the maximum salary of the marketing. Now, once we have those, we subtract them and we also need to get the absolute value of it. So return me the absolute value of the entire thing that we just calculated right and once we had this we also need to alias this as salary difference so as salary difference okay let me go ahead and run this let's see what do we get in our output so yeah, this is accepted our output is same as expected output let me go ahead and submit this pass all the test cases so yeah, this is accepted and this is how to do it so not a difficult question what we basically had to do was from the department called engineering we found out the maximum salary then what we did was we did the same thing for the marketing department we subtract the two and then we return the absolute difference and alias this as whatever was required in our output so yeah, this is how we do it. let me know if there's a better or more efficient solution to solve this question let the solution be in the comment section below and i'll see you guys in the next video